Wednesday uh, evening, March the 10th, 2021. It's about 4.53 uh, p.m. Greet everybody again uh, with a universal greetings of peace and the blessings of God be with you. No matter what your political, philosophical, personal, or religious beliefs may be. No matter with whether you're the richest or the poorest person on the face of this earth. No matter if you're the proclaimed toughest or the proclaimed weakest person on the face of this earth. No matter if you're my family, friends, nor my proclaimed enemies. It doesn't matter whether you like my YouTube uh, channel or any of my uh, social internet videos or speeches. Uh, my uh, YouTube video is Raymond, R-A-Y-M-O-N-D. I-V-I-V-Y. I encourage you to take a look at them. I got over a thousand YouTube videos. It doesn't cost you nothing but your undivided attention. Uh, it don't cost you no finance. This is a message to people all over, especially in the black community. But, uh, but uh, here in Charles, Missouri, Mississippi County, a message to the people that's uh, contributing to the black businesses here in Charles, Missouri, Mississippi County. Now, I'm going to tell you about some of the black business here in Charles, Missouri, Mississippi County. And those that live here, they'll know what I'm saying is true. Hey, hey, how you doing, brother? They'll know what I'm saying is true. Now, when you see these business individuals, black business people, giving out this food or having programs with the chief of police, the sheriff, the judges, you see what I'm saying? And all these other groups, all right now, all these other groups, but except being a part of the black community, you beware of, of uh, supporting those particular black uh, uh, individual businesses. You see, some of them is blackballing legitimate black businesses. It's about three or four black businesses here that are legitimate people. But you got these blacks that's working hand in hand with the, when I say white supremacists, I'm not speaking about all white people. All you got to do is just pay close attention. The blacks that you see in these newspapers all the time, as if they the black heroes, you will see them marching hand in hand when the sheriff or the or the chief of police or one of these judges that's doing nothing but locking up blacks that don't conform to submitting to them. You beware of these so-called black business people. Most of them is NAACP high-ranking individuals. Like I said, I had an episode with one today. You see what I'm saying? that told me to leave, to get away from out of uh, 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 a public street as if he owned it. He don't live on the black community, but they have all their little black programs. They'll, think, they'll have you thinking that they're trying to help the community. All you got to look at is, is the circle of people that they be having working for, for them, especially during the hard labor. Don't take the word of somebody about a black business person unless you do your investigation. I got a call today about uh, a black business that's transportation and they, they legitimate, they good, they clean, all their vehicles is up the box. But yet, since they ain't a part of the status quo, the good old boy system, they ain't a part of the bootlicking blacks or the sellout blacks who work hand in hand with the police department and the sheriff department that's oppressing the black community here on the west side of Charles, Missouri, Mississippi County. So then they gonna try to blackball these people. But now the same ones they blackballing, you can put one of their transportation vehicles up to just about all of them that be up here at 700 or uh, uh, West uh, uh, on Elm Street or Side Williams Avenue, and I guarantee you that one that they blackballing 
will give you a more comfortable ride. You ain't got to worry about no smoking. You ain't got to worry about work or, or somebody driving you that's drunk off of alcohol or high off of narcotics or smoking all in the van. Or in the wintertime, you freezing. In the summertime, you're burning up because ain't no heat or no air. Beware, y'all. These individuals that y'all think that's the leaders here in the community, all you got to do is look at the people they marched to, for with. People that they said that there was leaders in the community. One is facing life in prison, and the other one is on the run because he was out here selling drugs and doing things in the black community to oppress the black community, and then he got caught up. So now the feds have paid him to put him in hiding. And he helped these same black businessmen that I'm telling you about this black balling, the good black businessmen, these drug dealers that's locked up and on the run, they help those particular individuals. I'm going to leave for right now. I'm going to say this and, and say it one more time. Don't take the word of these individuals that you see in the newspaper all the time. Don't take the words of these individuals that you always see that's in the face of these judges. You see what I'm saying? NAACP, go to one of their meetings. Go to one of their programs and see how many people in the black community gonna be there. Peace be still.